Hey guys, it's Kirgli again with another video and this time I've got a insulation guide for this ROM which you may be able to see. It is MIUI V5 by iHackers which is, uh, well, it is based on the uh, stock Samsung uh, ROM for this device that is the Galaxy S3 and it has a few extra features which is useful while using MIUI. So let's get into it. Uh, let's start installing iHackers. It has the aroma package, light package and another package. So I am using the aroma package so that uh, you guys get what to make of with the features available. So uh, you have, you are installing iHackers MIUI V5 1.2 for Galaxy S3 iHacks uh, official based on the MIUI V5 official port. So this is uh, on the Android version 4.1.1 so keep that in mind. This is 1.2 version of this particular one. You can go to this guy's website to have a good impression of it. So yeah, let's see next. Now install ROM. Now it comes with a few kernels so you have the uh, ability to select so I'm gonna select BFL kernel, uh, boy flock kernel, okay you have the ability to select uh, Sia kernel, Google Mac kernel, Adam kernel so you have the options there. Now recovery you have the uh, choice of fills recovery, clockwork mode recovery and uh, team win recovery project recovery and um, so that's pretty neat. Now you have the boot animation for eye hackers that is a custom mute animation or the MIUI animation with the um, MIUI having a yeah, uh, orange color and that. So that's a pretty standard so I'm going to select uh, iHackers. So I guess that much is it. Now next. GApps, you have the GApps package. Uh, install small GApps package which uh, includes the Play Store and um, uh, required mods. So I believe that is essential. You have these uh, options too, audio mod, we have the audio mods. I will provide the links in the description so you guys can uh, note what are the audio modifications. So it has a higher volume, better sound, etc. It does have audio engine like uh, Viper, Acid and S-Force. I am going to select all the three. So yeah, performance mod and graphics mod, all of them good. Now Super Sue, Leipzig, uh, it's something different. Uh, it is the MIUI standard. Uh, root uh, manager I guess. Now ROM control I'm going to use uh, Trickster rather than S tweaks okay. Uh, miscellaneous Optus uh, his has uh, MIUI SPN configuration uh, pretty neat. Multilang add-on you can have multi-language pack but it is not going to be the uh, perfect multi-language package so uh, well if you guys want that you can use I myself only use English language so I'm not going to add that Cedar it's something to uh, have more speed and smoothness to your ROM so pretty neat next now launcher which launcher do you want you have MIUI home Apex launcher Nova launcher Holo launcher bus launcher and advanced Xperia launcher so I'm going with MIUI home that is the default MIUI language so yeah, pretty neat. Now, MIUI V5 for third party launchers. Pretty neat. Icon set, if you want icon set of MIUI 5, so you can have that. Now, widget. Fancy widget, clock widget, uh, on off, beautiful Sony on off, stock widget, uh, recent call, top contacts, you can have all that installed if you want to. I'm going to select all of them because, well, they are widgets. So yeah. Navigation, on-screen on screen navigation buttons. If you want to have that, you can enable that one. So that's pretty neat. Now, iOS 7 lock screen, you can have that enabled. Pretty neat. I'm going to enable that. Now, keyboard. Which keyboard you want? Uh, I would suggest going with Xperia Home because, well, that's more better, I guess. Well, I have used it in a few ROMs. I really found it useful. The next. Now, uh, install Glass Calendar, um, Glass Email. This are also um, apps which you can uh, select I'm going to select all of them now Google uh, G well the Google apps which you can have are these pretty neat these are themed I guess yeah main glass themed calendar glass themed email you can have that so I'm going to have um, Gmail glass themed um, yeah you can have all of these installed so pretty neat I'm going to select all of them 
while this may not provide the same level of customization than the uh, Ultima ROM, it does have a lot of features to look into. So I really like the um, features available in this. So I really like. So I'm going to use all these apps also. Twitter, uh, Flash Player, EX. Uh, yeah, I think that's it. Next. You have, um, again, apps and exposed framework alternative WSM tools is for MIUI it's really awesome it has a lot of features I'm going to install that now alarm time fix okay uh, browser auto fit carrier label okay uh, allow you to modify carrier label uh, track launch allows you to launch playback screen of current track okay email rotation extra battery info pretty neat I want that uh, holidays uh, keyboard FC, FC on Xperia keyboard. I have selected the Konami keyboard, so I would need that, I guess. Holidays, I don't want that. Uh, hide icon text in the launcher if you want that. MMS festival, MMS rotation. Play Store fixes. Uh, that is for if you're changing the density. Many apps may not be able to, may not show up on the Google Play Store, so you may be, need that one. Reboot extra options. That is four-way reboot. Pretty neat. T9 uh, module in the dialer. Uh, search in uh, Google Play using quick search box the uh, infamous quick search box of MIUI you can use that uh, team system authorization on internet you can use that one that's pretty neat now um, measure units in different languages and no, I don't want that volume skip track is really neat uh, it is from the uh, AOK science mode I guess it's really neat I really use that a lot again you have more apps okay fm radio in airplane mode okay i don't know what that is but i'll show you guys okay anti-spam i don't want this bug report uh calendar miui calendar app calendar provider data hub provider drm support these are all uh, miui apps i guess so i will be selecting all of these super chinese super, i don't want that because i'm i don't speak chinese frankly sorry about that uh, Exchange 2, Google Black Transfer, MIUI Compass is really awesome Compass app. I have used that in other ROMs. Now remove GApps. Hmm. I don't want to remove GApps. I'll keep it there. Please donate if you really consider his work unique and really appreciate him. I'll provide the link in the description below. So yeah, you can donate to him. That is it about the customization option. I really like this ROM. So that's why I made the uh, installation guide uh, it's pretty neat ROM so uh, hope you hope to see you guys with the ROM okay I'll make the video of the ROM next so see you guys later bye